Now let's look at what are the other ways to access elements in the list. You may just want to access a particular element. So how would you do it? Like typically when you write your own list, you number it. You know, one, two, three, four, five, six, just like a simple numbering. You do it exactly the same way here with only one key difference. And that key difference is the numbering here starts from zero. And how do you access it? Like in, when you're physically writing it, you know, you'll just say, you know, number one, number two. So here to access a particular element, you use that index in square brackets. So we are going to understand how to do it. So if you want to access the first element, it's going to start with zero. Now if you want to take it in a variable, le zero. Okay, that was le as an element and not, okay. You've seen it's printed elephant. The first element is, so that it's very clear. Now, what would be the next element? One, two, and three. So it will basically go on till the length of the list. You can access any of them. If you want to access like the third one, this time I will just print directly and we will say list of animals, the third element. Yeah? So that's horse. If you want, we, if we don't want to put the number and we want to say we want to print the last one, what do we basically want to do is we want to access the length. What is the length of this? It's four. But because the index, indexing starts from zero, pay attention, zero, one, two, three. So it's always length. So length of what? Length of list of animals. And we are going to subtract one from it. So if we run it, we will again get horse. Now the interesting way, that now, now I'm going to introduce one more very interesting way. If you want to access from the right hand side, like from the left hand side, it is zero, one, two, three. If I want to access the index from the other side of the list, then we can access using minus numbers and it starts from minus one this time and not zero, right? Because zero is this. So this cannot be zero. It starts with minus one, minus two, minus three and minus four. So you get horse using three different ways of indexing. Now, here is when I really need you to pause. Take a, like a blank big piece of paper make a list of five to 10 elements and really clearly index them. From left to right, go zero, one, two, three till the length of your list. And from the right, come back minus one, minus two, minus three till the length of your list in negative. Just, un just make sure that you understand how to create a list, how to print its length, how to iterate each element using the for loop, that is the for name of the variable, which will hold the element and the in keyword, or you can just print the value. And then just get very comfortable using the square bracket to access a particular element.